Because we have a little secret, huh, Ashley? Mm -hmm. They don't know. We're in the laundry room for a couple days and we didn't film, but I'm going, Jason and I are ready to go to the mall. Ashley is going to come with us, but I'm going to challenge Jason virtually. Challenge, challenge, challenge. Can anyone guess without... Do I get a thousand dollars if I do the challenge? <laughs> I don't know. You tell me you're in charge of the paycheck. <laughs> <laughs> Touche. Right back at you. I'm just trying to like follow the YouTube channels. Here. I know, I know. I'll, I'll give myself a thousand bucks. What is it? What's the challenge? To, to, to eliminate my existence in the house? Uh huh. No. Give me 30 this minutes isn't... and I can probably clean everything <laughs> else. No. To uh, not make this your office space. See, this is exact. <laughs> and to. It's noisy right here. And to clean off this space. Okay, so here's the thing. We're going back into virtual school um, where I'm doing all the kids from schooling from home. They all kind of have their own little routine. They don't all sit at the desk in there. I get it. But at the same time, he's off work two days a week, two weekdays a week, home doing some of his work amid them doing their schoolwork. So as soon as the air conditioning unit gets taken out of that room, which we're only a couple weeks away from that happening, even though it's gonna be like 97 degrees on Sunday. <laughs> Today is Friday. That AC unit is gonna come out and we can turn the desk back the regular way to fully utilize going back to school. It is going to look a lot different this year and we can do another video um, about that. But I do want that area kind of cleaned up. So I'm kind of challenging him on the, on the camera to kind of see if he can get this done. But Ashley, we're going to the mall, right? Mm -hmm. Just you and mom and dad? That usually means you get a little extra. And Chelsea yesterday said, Mom, can you get me chocolate? Because everyone who goes to Target with you gets some kind of like treat or something or a smoothie. And I was like, well, you didn't come with this. <laughs> so there's advantages to being with mom. I grew up the same way. Like if I was with my mom and I had to run an errand with her, especially if I had to like, we used to go out of town to go and meet my aunt, her sister, my aunt. They would meet halfway between where they lived. It meant we stopped at, you know, the gas station for a snack, and then we stopped for lunch, and then we stopped for another little drink on our way home. There's advantages to being with mom, right, Ashley? So today we are, I'm actually really excited, even though, well, we'll explain. We're going to the mall for the first time. I think I haven't gone since Christmas time. Ashley, we're trying to remember if we went during, I think I went in November. I think you guys went to like a Christmas present. Um, the like Maybe. You bought Abby's Christmas present. Oh, yeah. You went with me in November. Yeah, 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 yeah. So, um, yeah, that's the last time I've been at the mall. Honestly, so that was November of last year. It is the end of August. This is a really long time. That's like 10 months since we've been to the mall, which is totally fine. It's not my favorite place to be because I worked there for a really long time. We're going to the Apple store and I don't know about any of you if you're an Apple person, but it's like I get giddy. It's like the candy store. It's like, ooh, what are we gonna buy today? And actually Jason's buying quite a few things because he's having to like, it's been a couple of years since we've um, upgraded some of his work computers and such. So we went online last night, kind of priced things out, see what we can get. So come along with us to the mall and then we'll see if Jason, he's, he's a little irritated with me that I mentioned this whole office desk situation because, um, and Jason, you're watching this later, you know you are, because uh, he thinks his existence doesn't belong on the kitchen counter. I'm just, I don't want the office to belong on the kitchen counter because we're gonna go back to our same problems that we had during quarantine where I don't know if he's working or if he's, having fun on like social media, standing here at the counter. And then if I interrupt, then it's a problem if it's a work situation. But if he's at a desk, I know not to interrupt. It's another issue. So anyway, let's go to the mall. Also, I got a fun new wallet yesterday. Look how, I don't know, I'm like a mom. 
I love how big it is. I can't really show you a ton of stuff in here because it's like my credit card information, but I really like it. I can actually slip my phone down in there and then zip it up. And then there's a little handle if I want to take it. I actually transferred this, my wallet, to like my beach bags often. And so, you ready to go and hang out with mom and dad at the mall? Got your lanyard? Where's your mask? All right. I just want to be with you. I just want to be with you. Yeah. I just want to be with you. Yeah, I just want to be with you. I just want to be with you. I just want to be with you. Yeah. I just want to be with you. Yeah, I just want to be with you. I just want to dance all night. Forget my problems. I might go insane. I don't really give a fuck they say. And now you know. Alright, so it's always fun to go to the Apple store and the girl was funny because I pulled out my camera to kind of film like some b-roll or whatever and she's like, dude, are you guys vloggers? <laughs> and I was like, oh, do you appreciate that? And she's like, I really appreciate that. That is so cool. I've never met one. Your iron brake is on. Your brake is on. I'm killing my car. Why do you like put that on? Because I want to protect my car. Oh, we're going to go over a bump. Oh. Oh. <laughs> Anyway, um, so then she's like, oh, we got to get some, like, good shots. And so she helped set up, like, all the computers and stuff we got. And anyway, that was kind of fun. But we did get a new Mac, laptop, and an iPad, and a case for the iPad. The two things in a case. Yeah. And we need to go get some adapters online. She's like, don't buy them from here. They didn't have the right one. They didn't have the, the, yeah. She's like, it's easier to order them on Amazon. So... Now, or actually, we support the local little Mac accessory store. We don't have a local Mac it's accessory the, store. It's up by the uh, movie theater thing. There is? Yeah. Before we took the one and they determined the kids have ruined it. No. Oh, okay, whatever. And Ashley, you wanted a pretzel, right? Mm -hmm. But it's not going to cut it. We're already at lunchtime. So we're gonna go to Wendy's because we're down by Wendy's and we rarely get it because we're not close enough to it. So, and it's only $4 a meal. It's super cheap. So, we're gonna get some lunch. None of the kids wanted to come with us. They were all excited about going to the mall yesterday and then they all changed their pace late last night and this morning and none of them wanted to come, so. Your car's waking up. Oh, holy moly, wow, really that whole that. area. Holy cow, do you see that pit, you guys? That used to this be area there. right here. Oh, it's still there. So this shop right down here is where it says, what is that? City Sweats? City Sweats? <laughs> I don't even know. That's the first place to work outdoor. Yeah, he worked at Marmot Mountain Works. Marmot Mountain Works. When we very first got married. He worked right there, and then I worked not at this building right here. Oh, you can't see it. It's, it's behind literally there. behind these buildings right here. Yeah, it was like a cool outdoor store. We yeah. put people to go Everest, Antarctica, all over the world. But it looks like someone obviously like bought, well, this well, whole area owner, is bought the by owner, the owner passed owner. away. Not not your mountain store, but uh, this whole area down here in Bellevue is owned by one big, huge, massive conglomerate well, <laughs> of money. Yeah, there's two or three. And so, people. as soon as leases are up, they're putting sky rises in. It's turning into like the next Seattle. But it's cleaner than Seattle and better, so I'll take it. <laughs> <laughs> I guess. Yeah, they don't allow homeless, homeless people tents. and a month's worth of drugs. and. We don't need to go on to that little streak because Seattle's really having a bad time these days. Going so downhill. Going very downhill. Don't plan on going there for I've a very long stopped. time. I couldn't go do the bank deposits, night drop. No, I know, because they lived in the ATM. Homeless people were living in the ATM and stuff and they couldn't stop them. So. Yeah, my mom brings grandkids up here to travel and get out of the state every summer. We haven't done it for a couple summers because she had some health issues, but um, we were talking about doing it this summer before all this hit and I she's talking about different things that we could go and do and I was like I'm not taking them anywhere near Seattle well there's one thing the Great Wheel right down on the waterfront yeah you just pass the you know 
street of homeless yeah. people, and then you're fine. And then you're fine. And then you go to Red Robin right there on the wharf, and then you go that back was home. A sarcastic joke. Right? I know it was. You're being <laughs> whatever. Anyway, it's just not safe down there. I mean, it was safe during quarantine because there was no one down there. No well, not even homeless people. Yeah. So anyway, we're gonna get Wendy's. Add the frosty. Add the frosty. He doesn't like drive-through ordering at all. Like he's very self-conscious with it. And so to have to add something at the window is like beyond. Here, is, Ashley, is open your cup. Willingness. Mom's being a. He has a really hard time with this. I should have driven. I drove here, but I should have driven home. Oh, nice. He has a really hard time with she this. She doesn't get her. Give me the frosty, baby. Thank Give you. me the. <laughs> yeah. Oh, oh, daddy. It doesn't make dipping frosty fries easy in the car, huh? But it's still possible. It looks Where's like Kaylee's for? surprise package came. That's way bigger than I thought it was. No, you can't get on it. You can't get on it. Is that where your shoes go? Find a mess in this house and it belongs to you. Kaylee. That's a very large skateboard there. I get to film you if you get new things. No. Yes, I do. Yeah. No, but okay. So, like, do you have to put the board together? No, it is, but the way they... Can you not... Okay, so I didn't know what a truck was. Put Tell me, show me what a truck oh. is. Put the thing on it. That's a truck? Yes. This mechanism Yes, they're trucks. making fun of me because I have no idea. This is a cool board. My brothers didn't skateboard. I have all girls. I don't know skateboards. Uh. So is the truck not on right? Are you going to go out and skate on it? I'm not a skater. You don't want to just take it for a spin? It's, it's hers. I don't want to wipe out and <laughs> ruin the board. It's kind of fun though. Kaylee this paid cool. for this. She owes us a little bit of money. But no one's doing babysitting jobs right now. So she's got about it's 20 bucks to go. Tape. It's grip tape. She's going to take it to... Oh, I can't say. But we have a surprise that we haven't told you guys about. I was just going to give it away. What? She's taking it somewhere. She was worried about not getting it in time before she earned all of the money. So we went ahead and ordered it for her. Here's the thing is that I ordered it for her and was trying to do it in secret because she didn't have all the money for it. So I technically had told her that I wasn't going to order this board for her until I had all the cash on hand. But she wants it to be able to use for somewhere we're going. But when I ordered it, I turned off all the notifications on my Amazon so the Echoes didn't tell her that the package was going to be delivered. What? And I don't know if I just like missed one, but it, you heard it on the Echo. What'd you hear it on? How did you know? Yeah, she heard a no notification and, and then obviously it showed up today while we're gone. So we're very anticlimactic on surprising her with this before we go, but now she gets to go and hang out and learn how to ride it. Well, you've already ridden friends and stuff, yeah. so she's probably better at it than I think because I've never seen her on a bike on a she board. Friends, uh... Maybe she'll let me film her on it. Maybe from like the knees down. <laughs> Are you we know, doing it's... unveiling? Yes. I just think that opening up Apple products is like Bougie. super fun and satisfying. They didn't have the rose gold iPad that I wanted, but. It's not technically for me. It's just that usually I get like the hand-me-downs, right? Yeah, you're, you're like second, right? <laughs> well, what Kaylee doesn't know is that she's getting dad's old laptop. Yeah. <laughs> I know you've talked about it before. So, I'm just being honest. Dad is, this is dad's new computer. And These Kaylee's, girls are ahead of, the, ahead of the game, man. We can't trick them. I know, we can't like we hide any. Not to like, Again. I gotta get him good. Oh, whatever. So I, so Jason's got the new laptop for his work, and then he'll give Kaylee the old one. This um, iPad is for our staff to use to check work email and to you look to at product online. online to show customers like new colors or different styles of shoes. You can wear Chelsea's. We own a shoe store if you're new, but. It's just kind of fun. So I, well, we had a PC computer we were using to check email. PCs suck. And these things, and it just... It just isn't worth... Glitching, so I'm like... Why? Just save the hassle. Yeah. This is like... 
the same price as I love opening up okay. like a Costco laptop thing. Like, yeah. Mm. So it's so gonna, satisfying. Can I peel off the sugar? Oh, all the okay. Turn it over. Uh, oh yeah yeah yeah. I'm gonna turn it over, and then you. Oh, is it in a sleeve now? Oh, that's not as fun. Oh, it's just stuck on the back. I just love a mat, a, a new iPad, or anything. It's probably not charged at all. I'm trying to get Gilly on it. Well, we just need to have Dad tighten it then, right? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, it's a really nice board. Show them the back side. I love this part. That's like my favorite. I wish it was more visible, but it's really cool. Mm -hmm. Okay, I keep going back and forth on filming Kaylee and filming him. He's setting up the computers and the Mac, or the iPad, I mean. But uh, we have to get the adapter to be able to do a USB and um, headphones and, and all that kind of stuff. But you know, Jason and his little Amazon Prime, he can get it after either tomorrow or Sunday. So thank you, Prime. He mocks me in my Prime. Okay, here's the girls. Let's see what Kaylee's doing. Okay, is it working better? What? Is it working better? Kind of. Okay, go for a spin. Let me see. All right, all right, go for it. She wants to butt board it, but I want her to go on it. Yeah. Jason is uh, wanting me to stoke his ego and show you his latest project. Are you gonna open it? Okay. All right, why don't you explain what, what you have been doing? I've already replaced it. Oh, you replaced one I of these little hinges, it, right? But they're, they're not lined up and so it creates a bend in this lower bracket and that's right where it snapped. So, I mean, it'll probably last a long time, but if I can go to the outside and push it in and line it up better. So you're gonna go on the other side and push it in while I stand here? It's fine, and I'm asking. Stand here. Yeah. He's still thinking this through. And I'm gonna come back around in, and hopefully I can cinch him up. Okay. So he's been working, the garage door has been like blipping out. Um, part of it is the sensors don't like direct sunlight, like they're right down here. See the red light on this one? And then the green light on this one. When there's direct sunlight really beating down on those sensors, it kind of like throws them off and doesn't make them work. You can tell that the Seattle doesn't, it, like it's weird to get sunlight. And so even like the garage door freaks out. But it's also like been stopping halfway up. And I think it is because this hinge up here broke. So he came out here earlier and he, uh, you know, saw that this whole bracket was like broken off. And so he went and got a new one from Home Depot. Like, oh crap, you scared me. It like to death. Oh my God. That scared me so bad. <laughs> I knew he was going over there, but I like, I forgot and I didn't know how much he was gonna like pound on this. Our day is really random, you guys, but, but I'm glad he's getting this fixed because it's really annoying to come home or try and leave and not have the garage door work but we could probably spend hundreds, if not thousands, to have someone else try and figure this out for us. And yes, they might know exactly what to do, but we can figure it out ourselves. So that lines up better now? It's a little more lined up, so hopefully less stress right On here. those little brackets. I mean, it took a long time to break, but we might as well fix it if we're doing it. Yeah, let's see if it works. Oh, what was that noise? I don't know. Huh. 
Huh. Well, we've had a productive day, wouldn't you say? Oh yeah, I got. I fixed a lot of stuff. He's watching my videos. He's such a supportive husband. <coughs> Making comments. I, I always appreciate your comments. I'm always trying to reply to them. <laughs> yeah. I, I love reading them. No, I know. It's, that's what I tell you. Like he enjoys it just as much as me. But oh, I. I need to, ladies. <laughs> anyway, we're gonna call it a night. He's gonna go for a run. Got to get the kids in bed. This one over here, doing her normal thing. But we just had dinner. Just kind of haphazard, whatever people feel like. It's how we're we, yeah, it's how we're doing it these days. My good salad. Stop. Don't even get me started. Um, <laughs> here, eat this banana. I can't. I already have one today. <laughs> yeah, conversations with how many bananas are appropriate to eat in one day. And Chelsea is at her max. Let's just say that. But anyway, we're going to call it a night. I'm tired. I want to go relax. Oh, that's clean. Are these clean? No, they're not. They're dirty. But take care. Stay tuned till tomorrow. As you have probably... <laughs> Jason, it's disgusting. As you might have picked up, I have... I believe we're at day four of posting videos. Let me turn this off. Let me see here real quick. Yes. This will be day four this week that I have posted a video. And I'm gonna post another one tomorrow. So five days in a row, I will have a video. You're gonna wanna stick to, stick around and watch tomorrow's. Cause we have a little secret, huh Ashley? They don't know. Mm-hmm. Uh-huh. She's eating one more cracker before she goes to bed. We have a secret we haven't been talking about. We will reveal part of the secret tomorrow. And then the rest of the, the secret next week like all of the secret next week like the whole, we'll tell you what it is we'll tell you everything we'll show you everything so stick around subscribe click the like the bell all the things and come back and find out what our secret is all right you guys take care and we'll see you next time